Black China sends love to Dream's aunt, Kim Kardashian in the wake of losing criticism preliminary. Black China sends love to Dream aunt Kim Kardashian in the wake of losing criticism preliminary too. Black China and Kim Kardashian Shuttershock. All previously, in a recent interview, Black China gave credit to Kim Kardashian, giving the impression of subtly dismissing her conflict with the Kardashian Jenner family. Welcome viewers to my channel. Please subscribe, like my video and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next update. Everything said about Black China's defamation lawsuit against the Kardashians, during an interview with Hollywood Unlocked, China, 34, wore a t-shirt that featured a sensual picture of Kardashian, 42, from the spring 2023 ad campaign for Dolce & Gabbana. The model discussed her choice of clothing in greater detail in a video that she posted on Instagram on March 27. China, who was born Angela White, explained, Well, I love Dolce & Gabbana, but I wore this shirt today because I wanted to support Kim. She collaborated with Dolce, which I admire, and she is Dream's Andy. The native of Washington, D.C. was referring to her six-year-old daughter, whom she and Rob Kardashian have together. Shortly after Dream was born in November 2016, the tumultuous relationship between the two previous couples ended. After losing her defamation trial, Black China sends her love to Kim Kardashian's Dream Auntie. Photo courtesy of Black China, Instagram following her split from Rob, 36, the influencer filed a lawsuit against his family, claiming that they were to blame for the cancellation of their reality show, Rob and China. She sought $36 million in emotional distress damages and $109,635,021 in economic damages. Kim and her mom, Kris Jenner, alongside sisters Khloe Kardashian and Kylie Jenner asked the Los Angeles Better Court then excuse the case not long from now before it went to jury. In a statement that was published in Us Weekly in April of 2022, their attorney Michael G. Rhodes called China's claims, absurd. Before the official verdict was made in May 2022, the selfish author was found not guilty of defaming China. A judge dismissed the case at the time, and China was not compensated in any way. The family learned of their court triumph while planning for the 2022 Met Affair in New York City. Before the event, Chris, 67, told Variety that the hardest part was, going through it, in the public eye. I'm just happy it's over. I simply hope that my faith will suffice as I live my life. I'm glad the girls are safe now. We are here to rejoice. In the meantime, China's legal team told the Associated Press that they intended to appeal on the remaining questions from the trial. The real Black China alum has not made it clear where she stands with the Kardashian Jenner family in light of the legal drama. She turned her attention to the next chapter in May 2022. The founder of Lashed by Black China has since documented her journey to get rid of previous cosmetic enhancements, including having her fillers dissolve and having her breasts reduced. Exclamation mark. It's even not worth it. I didn't give my body time to fully develop before I got fillers. In a video that she posted to Instagram earlier this month, she stated, trust me, it's going to come. The snatched face you require as you get older is coming. Then, as you get older, you'll say, ah, I miss my baby face.